We're always told what to buy in men's style and fashion, but really what is worth your money? Here's my top 10. Building a wardrobe and kind of working out your own sense of style is really, is really hard actually. You know, I've looked back at old pictures of myself and I'm wearing stuff that I think is really questionable and things which I've spent a lot of money on and I've worn once or stuff that just is too trend led and really lasts a season and then after that, it's gone. So in this video, I've gone through 10 items of clothing that really every guy should have in their wardrobe. Now, before I get going, if you are new to my channel, then hi. I am Robin, this is Man From Self in the new Man From Self HQ, really my office and studio. If you're new to my channel, you've not yet pressed subscribe, then please do hit subscribe right now. The button is just below this video, also that bell button, make sure it's clicked. Now, first in my top 10, it's all about a good pair of jeans. Now, straight leg, skinny jeans, boot leg, if you do that, then do it with confidence. You know, whatever style you like, buy a good quality pair. Try on different shapes, different styles, different colors, and see what suits you. Second on my list is all about a plain t-shirt. Now, white is, is the perfect way to go. Again, you can't really go wrong, and this can go under a blazer, or under a sweatshirt, or by itself with shorts. But for me and my sort of color palette, I'm all about grays, blues, black sometimes, and white. So a, a gray t-shirt, I think, just suits my coloring far better. Next on my list is all about shirts. Now, whatever age you are, whatever you do for a job or at college or school, every guy needs a good shirt. And whatever style that may be, the most important thing in this is getting the right fit. Now, I've been working with Taylor Store. They've got this amazing app. It's called Taylor Store Size Me. I'll link it down below, but it is on the uh, Google Store and it's also on the Apple App Store. So you'll be able to get it for all your devices. But you just pop it against a wall. You take a picture of yourself in their sort of silhouette. You put in your height and you put in your body weight. And it basically works like the best fitting shirt for you. I actually thought this seemed too simple but I got three shirts from there and they are the perfect fit. But one of the best things about this is you can customize the shirt to get something that really suits you. You can go for something which is very traditional and something which can be worn more like a dress shirt for say a wedding or for the office. So I just went with this really sort of plain white shirt. You can change the collar on it, you can change the cuff, you can do the placket, so that's the bit down the front with the buttons. You can also do any contrast, then you can do that. So there's loads of different things you can do here. But again, the most important thing is, uh, you know, you can go as wild as you want with your style or as traditional as you want, but get a good fit. So what I'll do is I'll link it on the App Store, the Google Store there too, and also their website. Work, wedding, funeral, or maybe even a night out, a suit is an essential. It is so versatile. If you want to see really five ways to wear your suit, then you can click the link in the cards. It will take you to the video I did just the other week. Now next on my list, and really what I see as an essential, is a leather jacket. Now you can go as Danny Zuko as you want, in sort of black leather with all the sort of hardware and the zips, or you can wear something a little bit more modern, uh, like the coach jacket I've done here. I say modern, it's very sort of 1950s varsity jacket. But you know, whatever you decide to do, buy something that is great quality, because again, this will last. And as with all of these things, that I'm listing here. There's a full article on manforhimself.com with some key picks in each category. So if you're looking for inspiration or some really cool items, then you can check that there. It will be linked in the info card up there. But next on the list is all about formal shoes. Now, you might be someone that works in an office environment and has to dress quite smart, or you might have gone to a wedding and then you've got a pair of shoes. But again, buy a good quality pair of shoes. Brogues, Oxfords, monk straps, or maybe even Chelsea boots. But whatever you buy, buy it well. Next on the list and moving from the sort of more formal side to something which is totally relaxed and really very versatile and that is a pair of white trainers or sneakers depending on what you want to say here. And actually you will have seen even in the video that I did the other week with the suit that you can take a suit and you can wear the uh, t-shirt and a pair of white trainers to bring a sort of more modern contemporary vibe to something which is seen qu as quite formal or you can really wear them just with a pair of jeans because you know in this whole list Versatility is key. Sort of buying good things that last and not just chucking your money at everything. But also don't worry about them getting slightly dirtier because they actually do look great worn in. Next on the list, we're going with a sweatshirt. I'd always say 
by a crew neck. One, it's gonna be the most flattering on your body shape. If you're a slightly bigger guy, especially sort of wider on the shoulders and you've got a slightly bigger chest, then a V-neck is really gonna draw attention into that area. And the same really for guys that are slightly slimmer. It's gonna make you seem slightly narrower. If you've got a crew neck, it's gonna keep you more proportionized. Proportionized? More in proportion. And finishing up on accessories, the first one is a bag. Now gone are the days where you say man bag, it's just a bag guys, seriously, to the gym, to work, a weekend away, buy a bag, seriously. And some of the favorite ones across various brands and prices, again, is on manfromself.com. Now last on the list, accessory which I have in my bag the whole time, which it doesn't matter if it's summer, spring, winter, autumn, I've always got a pair of sunglasses. There's really sort of two things here. One is for eye protection, so get ones which aren't just coloured plastic. Get the ones which are going to help to protect your eyes. Let's go for a classic style. So at the moment you're seeing these tiny little ones which are totally on trend, but I guarantee fast forward three years and they will be out. So really think more of that sort of Wayfair style, maybe something slightly square, and also go for a classic colour. But guys, all of these things, again, are on manfromself.com, plus more, so if you want to check those out, you can. Also, the links to Taylor Store, the Size Me app, link down below, and also the website with my three customized shirts that I've created. But thank you again for watching. If you're new to the channel and you've not yet pressed subscribe, then please do press subscribe right now. The button is just up there. So there's more video suggestions down there. Stay with me and watch them. Head to my blog, it's there. Uh, links to different videos, and also my Instagram is up there. Come and follow me. But I'll see you in my next new video. Bye-bye.